<laughs> Helped out at the daycare center. I don't want to play house. Let's play hide and seek. You're it. Utah is full of energy. Once again, the children tug at you from all directions. Your understanding is increased. Yukun, most of the children have been picked up, so you can go home now. I'll see you next time. Finished my job and went home. Nice. And I earned 5,000 yen. Double nice. On the way home, on the Sumagawa floodplain. That's the mo yeah, yeah, that's Yuta's mother. Oh, hello. Oh, you're, you're the caretaker I met the other day, right? Yeah, that's me. Oh, it's already this late? I've been sitting here all this time. Is something on your mind? Oh no, it's nothing. <laughs> You're a high school student, right? You seem so mature. I don't like where this is going. I was headed over there. I was going to pick up Yuta. Then something came over me. My legs just went weak all of a sudden. Every time I think about him... Yuta's mother sighs. Have you heard? Yuda and I aren't related by blood. He's my husband's child. I've lived with Yuda for six months now. Only six months. Already six months. We don't ever talk to each other. My husband is away, so... <laughs> Just the two of us, alone together in a dark house. <sighs> Yuda's a good kid. Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to tell you all this out of the blue. But I'm glad you listened to me, that you spoke with me. <laughs> it's sad, but these days, I don't even get to have simple conversations like this. Yuna's mother is smiling weakly. It seems she is trying her best to adapt to living in the countryside. You feel a faint bond performing between me and Yuna's mother. Ah, social link. Uh, okay. I, that's, I recognize that card from things. The Temperance, she's Temperance. Okay, that's cool. Her name is Young Mother, oh boy. I'm Ari Manami. Thank you, now we have a name. Ari, nice to meet you. Please take good care of him. Oh, that's right, still need to pick him up. It was nice seeing you. Yeah, you too. She seems sad. Hope she gets happier. Oh, welcome home, big fro. Thanks, Naka Nanako. I said Nakata. Um, all right, well, I can hit you. Nothing catches my eye. Can go out in the evening too. Hmm. All right, let's go out. Let's see if anybody is available. And if not, let's, we can check back in with Nanako. Uh, shopping district, of course. Oh. Uh, oh. Oh, there's so many people. Oh, no. Oh. oh, it's you. What are you doing out so late? I'm doing overtime. Sometimes it sucks to be a grown up. If it was daytime, they wouldn't know if I slacked off a little. Oops. Oh, too far, Adachi. Well, you should go home before it gets too late. Adachi seems busy. You should talk to him again when he looks like he has more time. Okay, well, these people have enough time. Oh, shoot. How am I going to choose three? Huh? She wants to go out? Yeah. Let's go. A lively place. I want to go to Juness. I heard about that place. Yeah, let's go. Juness, electronics department. Dragged here by the excited Marie. Hey. Hey, what happened just now? Time sale? Everyone was rushing to grab something called Sala dressing? Whatever it is, it must be worth fighting for. Hey, Yukun, what a coincidence. What are you doing here? Who's this girl? She's so cute. Uh, a friend. 
Am I? Well, whatever. Oh, uh, uh, can I ask for your name? Huh? Oh, um, Marie. Marie looks perplexed. Marie Chan, huh? Ooh, that's a nice name. Oh, I'm Chie Satanaka. Nice to meet you. Mm hmm. Okay. I know what this is. It shows a lot of stuff. Hmm. Oh, you came to look at the TVs, too? Yeah, I want one, too. We still haven't replaced our old one. Whatever. I don't want one. I don't, but... Maybe you can... Can you turn it to... Star Scandals? Uh, so you do want one. I said no. No, I don't. I just was wondering how you're supposed to watch it. Marie seems interested in the TV. So how do you watch it? Explain to her how to use the TV. Are you one of those people who doesn't watch TV? That's right. There isn't one in the room. Really? Wow. You must have super strict parents. Girl, I don't think I could stand it. Life without kung fu movies. Urgh. Oh, but there's no eclectic loutwits in that room. Electric outlets, got it. I'll tell the nose to install one of those eclectic loutwits. There's nothing to do in there. Hey, wait, Mari chan you don't even have electricity in your room? <laughs> Good grief. Junez, food court. Came with Maria, uh, Marie and Chie. <laughs> Whew, that was the good stuff. Satisfaction. I haven't had the steak here in a while, but it really isn't all that bad. Marie Chun, you haven't eaten at all. You too, Yuku. You gotta eat if you want to grow up big and strong. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> you eat too fast. You're gonna be fat one day. I didn't need to hear that. I'll go get some uh, some drinks. Oolong tea sounds good. You should apologize, Marie. That was a mean thing to say. There's a lot of people at this Junez place. Why? Don't they have anything else to do? If they have TVs, they should be watching them instead of wasting time here. Mommy, I'm thirsty. I want a soda. No, you just had one. You'll have to wait. I want it. I want it. I said no. You'll rot your teeth. Oof. Marie watches the mother and son. Hey. Do you think I was ever like that? Uh. You don't remember? Mm -hmm. Yeah, there's a lot I don't remember. Everything. Marie looks serious. I don't remember anything. I was just walking. I had nowhere to go and I just ended up in that car. Then Margaret told me to stay there. She also gave me the name Marie. It'd be hard to get around without a name. That must be rough. I don't know. Can't even remember if it was tough. That's okay. It's not like it's troubling me or anything. Despite her casual words, Maria is a concerned expression. But I don't know why, but this town is familiar to me. Do you remember anything else? I don't know. The only thing I remember, or more like know, is that this is mine. Maria is holding an old bamboo comb in her hand. I had this from the start. This is definitely mine. But so what? This doesn't help anything. Marie confided in you about her memory. Our relationship has grown deeper. Only to two. Gotta get on that. All right. Hmm. You're searching for the truth, right? You should stop. There's no such thing. Stupid. This conversation's boring. Let's talk about something else. Sorry to keep you waiting. 
The shop is busy, so I just ordered and came back here. They'll bring it to us when it's ready. Uh, is it me, or is the mood a bit heavy around here? But don't worry, you two. I ordered for all of us. Oolong tea for everybody. See ya. After talking with Mari and Chie, Marie and Chie, you escort Marie back to the velvet room. Sounds good. Got a rank what? up? Ah, oh, thanks, Nanako. Give it a nice save here. Alright. Well, I'm gonna have to call it here. Um, but this has been great. Um, I'll be back again. Uh, probably not tomorrow. I think I'm busy tomorrow, but maybe I'll try to squeak one in if I have enough time. Um, other than that, I'll be back Tuesday. I'm still going to try to work on getting stream elements up to snuff, um, because as it stands right now, uh, I haven't switched the bot yet, and I still haven't fixed the alerts and the overlays and the scenes and stuff. Like, there's still a holdover from my other uh, days with Streamlabs. So um, I'm still going to try to switch it over, so we'll see what we can do. Um, but let me see who is available right now, and I will give them a good old-fashioned raid. It's perfect for it. Gotta flatten that ground, though. Was someone once planning to fix up this yard? There are tools around here you think you can use. You should be able to make a nice garden with these. Use the tools here to make a garden. Your diligence has increased. And has gone from callow to persistent. Nice. Wow! Ooh. Can we plant the seedlings now? That looks actually pretty good. Planted the tomato seedlings together with Nanako. Do you think the veggies will grow? Um, sure. I mean, probably. Uh, they will if we work hard. Mm -hmm. I'll do my best to take care of them. Oh, that's good. All right. No one will know what we planted until the veggies grow. Oh. I gotta write down that there are veggies growing here. Say veggies again. You're so adorable. Uh, what kind of sign do you want? Um, a big one. Okay, well, we can't go with an enormous sign. Oh, that's not bad. Put up the sign you made with Nanako next to the garden. The sign is small, but it makes for the perfect finishing touch. We did it! Sure did. I'll be in charge of watering the plants. Oh, good. Um, <laughs> it's all up to you. Uh, I'll help too. Okay. We planted them together, so we should grow them together too. Nanako seems happy. If a lot of veggies grow, will our house be like Juness? Um, can you grow TVs? <laughs> I can't wait! There are seedlings planted in the garden. You should check on them frequently until it's time to harvest them. Nice. I'm sure that'll be helpful. A rainy school day. Yo! Hey, Yosuke. Looks like the rain will stop in the afternoon. Forecast was saying it'll be a while before any fog shows up. This'll be a cinch. Yeah, I'm counting on you, leader. I mean, it will be a cinch. We got this in the bag. Though I do have plenty of uh, ways to go, don't I? Should we haul class and take a nap? Keep up, assholes. Where's your dignity? The first years are slacking off because you guys are slacking off. Kanji Tatsumi is a perfect example. That lazy punk is always ditching. 
I'd expel his ass from school if I were his homeroom teacher. You may not think it's any of your business, but it is. You could all be expelled just as easily. Cause any problems, and you earn a one-way ticket out of this place. You keep that in mind. Okay. <laughs>